Hey there, JGT. I have with me my girl, Rachel Christina here. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> hello. We are going to be talking about the talk my mom and I never had. We're talking all about menopause. If you're in your 30s, if you're in your 40s, tune in, ladies. So let's begin with Christina. All right, Christina. So I want you to tell me a little bit uh, just about your journey with fitness okay. and then kind of how the menopause thing started and how that all panned out. Oh, wow. Um, my fitness journey has been on and off, on and off for several years, mm -hmm. okay? Um, uh, let's just take it back to the last two years, two and a half okay. years, okay. Um, where I had worked out before, lost weight, mm -hmm. thought I was maintaining, things mm -hmm. like that. But then after a couple years later, I started to put on more weight. Let's not forget I got lazy. Okay. And I stopped exercising as much as I was exercising previously. Okay. So that kind of helped compact the weight gain. And then, of course, I thought I could eat whatever because okay. I had tricked myself into believing that the exercise was going to keep me at a nice, even weight. Okay. okay. So how much did you work out before? You said you were working out pretty regularly and slacked off. What was regular for you? Well, what was regular for me is that I was working out at least five days a week. Okay. Religiously. Okay. I was um, doing the treadmill. All right. I started challenging myself okay. to actually do the stair climber, things I kept thinking I'm going to stay away from. Right, right. And I kept saying, okay, I'm going to try this, try that. And what I did is that I just kind of incorporated it just gradually. Okay. And so I found myself when I was going to do cardio, I did a little bit here of treadmill and then I switched over and did the Stairmaster. So you kept switching so it I up kept with your body it so it wouldn't plateau. I kept switching it up and then of course you know I was looking at all the women and the guys in the gym lifting weights and I said you know what I'm getting ready to start lift a little bit and what I found is that it really really did help me. Okay. I started to lean out. And I started to get this body that I had not had before. Even though my diet wasn't quite the way it should have been, okay. I was doing that, but I found that when I was doing that, I wasn't as interested as in eating the same things that I was before. Yep. Yep. So that's really what it was, that up and down thing, up and down thing, and then you know, the older you get, you just kinda, you think that it's not as important, but okay. it really is. So let's segue there. So now, you're getting older mm -hmm. and you start hitting the change in life. Menopause is when women yeah. stop having a menstrual period. Yes. They're no longer going to have children anymore, right. so they stop have, uh, ovulating. Right. And when they hit that period, the hormones in our body, the estrogen and the progesterone, they start shifting and fluctuating right. like crazy. Well, when you're in your 20s, those hormones are pretty stable. Yes. And that helps us maintain that hourglass figure we like. Well, when you go into menopause, they start going crazy. Start going crazy. <laughs> and then weight gain starts to take place. Yes. Absolutely. Among other things. Uh, you know, absolutely. Your, absolutely. Your, your mood and everything. But let's yes. talk about how you notice that change with the weight gain in menopause. Well, that's interesting that you say this because... I just turned 54 okay. last month. And you look good, girl. Okay, thank you. I'm a work in progress. Yes. And so I am now into the menopause phase. It's okay. what I just found out from my doctor. Okay. And so we're kind of working on some things right now. And so this is where I am. Okay. And so now that I'm here, I'm finding that what I thought I didn't need to do, ah. I have to do. What's the, I thought I didn't need to do? What is that? I thought I didn't need to change my diet. And I had tricked myself for a long time with, Girl. you know, the exercising. You're messing with our food. The now. muscular, on. On. the cardio. The I was tricking myself. Okay. Because what I found out is that as you get older and get into the menopause stage, okay. everything slows down. Yes. That, that yes. to include your metabolism and so we have to do something more okay. mm -hmm. to keep it up in order okay. to burn and then we have to make sure that we're not uh, eating so much of the fatty foods, yes. the salt, yes. the sugars, yes. uh, things like that that are really going to hold on to the tissue. Yes. And so 
that's exactly where we are. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of JGT with my Fit with Renee buddy, Rachel Christina. We will be back with more.